welcome back to learn economy today we are going to discuss the concept of non accelerating inflation rate of unemployment this is also known as nairu or we call it as nairu let's discuss what it is the non accelerating inflation rate of unemployment would show the lowest level of unemployment or this would show the minimum level of unemployment that would be happening in the economy before the inflation starting to inch higher so here we could see that we are discussing what is called a phillips curve and where we measure unemployment along the x axis and inflation along the y axis and in our phillips curve shows the trade off between inflation and unemployment as i have already discussed in the previous video this involves the short run phillips curve if you have any doubt regarding the uh, difference between short run phillips curve and long run phillips curve uh, you can watch the videos uh, in learn economia which discuss the ideas of both short run phillips curve and long run phillips curve i'll be providing the links of these in the description box coming back to the explanation we could see that when it comes to short run phillips curve uh, here we can ha have a trade off between inflation and unemployment and when unemployment is at the nairu level that means the unemployment when it is at the lowest minimum level inflation would be steady and that is what is considered and since we do have a trade off between inflation and unemployment in the short run whenever our unemployment rises in the economy this will lead to something called a fall in inflation and also we could see that whenever unemployment in the economy falls this will lead to an increase in inflation this is something that will happen only in the short run this trade off can happen only in the short run and that is what we could see now we have to understand that there is actually no set formula to determine the particular rate of nairu nox non accelerating inflation rate of in unemployment is something that would be fixed uh, but there is no set formula there is no uh, specified formula or specified method to determine the same and in such a scenario what uh, the federal reserve has done is that it has historically used some statistical method to put the non accelerating inflation rate of unemployment between a between a scale and actually this is between usually between 5 to 6 percentage unemployment so this 5 to 6 percentage unemployment is considered this is considered as nairu by the federal reserve so here we could see that assessing this non accelerating inflation rate of unemployment limit or level uh, amid this inquiry into inflation as well as unemployment this is something that had helped the central bank of the us economy in its goal to attain maximum employment with some price stability we have to consider this because as a central bank a federal reserve is considered to be the uh, central bank of the us of us economy and for the very same reason it is the role of the central bank uh, of every economy to consider for certain objectives and here federal reserve too is not an exemption federal reserve also aim to attain maximum employment and it also aims to attain price stability and uh, federal reserve believes that by fixing nairu to be something between 5% to 6% it could attain its objective of maximum employment and price stability on the downside what happens here is that nairu has some issues and what could be the issues here nairu does not account for variety of factors that would be in influencing unemployment besides inflation we could see that when it comes to unemployment 
it is influenced by so many factors many factors influence unemployment and one of the factor here is inflation and this is what is established by phillips curve so when it comes to nehru nehru just take care of the rule of inflation when it comes to unemployment all the other factors are neglected or not taken care of or not considered by nehru and there exists a historical connection between inflation and unemployment and and that was something which was established by phillips curve using um, that was established uh, by phillips curve and it was a kind of uh, explanation that was done by phillips but later on as i have explained in the construction of long run phillips curve by doing the class on long run phillips curve i told you that the idea of the original short run trade off between inflation and unemployment had broken down after some point of time so that made nehru less effective means the breakdown of short run phillips curve breakdown of short run phillips curve has made nehru less effective so historical connection between inflation and unemployment can break down rendering nehru less effective that's all about non ax rating inflation rate of unemployment hope you could have some idea on the same topic i request you to like share and subscribe to this channel for more videos you can also be a part of our free telegram community i'll be providing the link of that in the description box also you can download learn economy app for that also i'll providing the link in the description box that's it thank you for watching